surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Hey guys, um, I'm back. This video, I, uh, well, I recorded it without turning on my mic. So, what you're listening to now is a video voiceover. And, uh, Would you I feel come so over stupid. These turrets, man. I think this almost kills me. But, uh, anyways, I was going to edit it. And I was watching it through it, and I was like, why can't I hear myself? And I realized, basically, I've been recording Team Fortress 2. If you guys know what that is. It's um kind of like Call of Duty, I guess. But anyways, um, I was recording that without a mic. And I was just gonna make a montage. I didn't realize that if I um, exited Snagit, which is what I used to record, if I exit that with the uh, mic off, it stays off the next time. So I don't know. now I know, but that won't be happening again. So. Also, <laughs> it was kind of funny too because. That day I was recording it, I was thinking, I wonder what it'd be like if I just did a voiceover and stuff. And I was thinking, like, of other YouTubers, like, sometimes they, they always, like, forget to uh, plug in their mic or something. I was like, I won't ever do that. You know, it, I'll be okay. But, and I was in the middle of recording something. I don't know. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. See, I'm, see, I'm looking for neurotoxin in this team right now. But, I don't know. Anyways, this will be alright for this time. And next video, I promise you I'll have just uh, me recording it right away because I'm not going to forget do that a second time. So that's the other Now I uh I'm trying to figure out here. You yeah, you have to do that and then you have to take it away once you get on the platform so that way you can uh, light up it. But anyways. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. <laughs> Surprises are not good. With GLaDOS, you just you can't be surprised. You just can't, uh... To her, surprise means death. Don't know why, but it's not what it means. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. So there's gonna be a bunch of I made it all up. Another tube. So I'm back in the corner. Confetti. Surprise. Surprise. Oh come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. Yeah. So I very seriously doubt they even want to see you. Yeah, well, let's go. I freaked out there too. I thought there was a glass. No, there's a turret here. For some reason, I know there's a turret there, but at one point I step out and like almost get killed by it. Just because, I don't know why. I think it's like going to happen in a couple seconds, but... Sometimes I, uh, hear this. Sometimes I, uh, do some stupid things. It actually takes me a long time to figure this out. But there's some place over there that I can portal to. There's a button I can hit. And, uh, it just changes everything. Because I couldn't, um, I just couldn't figure it out before. I'm, I don't know why I don't hit the button. But... Anyways, that kind of catches me off guard. But then I remember that there's a light bridge over there. I can use that. And something also I don't notice is I actually get two cubes. If you watch closely, I thought I only got one. So it just, um, I don't know how I didn't see that. Hindsight is, uh, different. I walked right past the cube. Do you see the shadow? I walked right past the cube to get this one. I almost died doing it, and I just killed the guy. But you think cube is a uh, shield. I, I just completely missed the cube, too. I don't even see it right now. So, uh, I don't know how long it takes me to figure it out, but there's a cube there, but... 
I'm sure I see it. I've seen it by now. And here I think I try to figure out where the turret's pointing so I can just put the laser there. But there's that black wall in front of me there. So I can't just put it directly on it. But I just um I almost died again, obviously. I put a blue portal over uh, behind the glass wall. I just kind of I don't know, figure out how to do about it. So I know about the cube by now, I think. Why is this taking me so long? It's probably what you guys think, like, what is he doing? Actually, I think there's a little bit more I can do with it. I feel awful about that surprise. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. The bird parents who are trying to reach do not love you. Please hang up. Oh, that's sad. Aww. But impressive. That's Maybe sad. they worked at the phone company. That's sad. Lados is such a... She's so hilarious. Oh. I forgot about that. Hey! How's it going? I talked my way onto the old nanobot work crew rebuilding this shaft. They are really such a... I know, Jerry! No, I'm on a break, mate. On a break. Ow! Just hang in there for five more... What? Jerry, you can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. It makes no sense. Comedy plus tra plus no comedy plus time does not equal tragedy. Like, think okay. Let me think about it. I was doing this I think when I was playing this too, trying to figure it out. Comedy. If you laugh about something and it takes you a while, that I hate how that pops up. When you laugh at something and then a long time later it's sad. Right? Comedy equals tragedy plus time. Oh, no, 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 okay. Something tragic plus time is funny. That makes sense. You, know, you ever done something stupid like what I'm doing now? And uh, then it's funny later. I don't know. It takes me a long time to figure this out for some reason. I, uh... You gotta get these cubes and redirect the laser by three different points, and you see I get the cube here. And um, that's the second one. You saw me get the first one. I leave it up here, I don't know. I'm trying to figure out a way to portal up. I'm just completely stumped. You can see me jumping here, just like trying to figure out what to do. I I swear I did that for at least 10 minutes. <laughs> just try to figure out what to do. But here I think I finally figured it out. I grab the cube and come down here. And uh, what you're supposed to do is put a portal under you. You're supposed to jump up and then the portal under you is supposed to change the other one to... Maybe I didn't figure it out here. Because it doesn't seem like I am. I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I probably didn't. But, um... Anyways, I think you'll see me doing it. Now. You're supposed to jump up. Any day now. So that's what you're supposed to do, and then you fly over there. I don't know why. It's so sunny. I guess that's hindsight. I'll figure out these things forever. But then you hit it, you see that other orb over there, or whatever it's called. You gotta get that one, and then there's, I think, the end laser. You need one more cube, which is up there on that really tall thing that I'm looking at. 
so I, uh, I get that. thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both of us. Ha! One of both of us. How hilarious. I was laughing, actually. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right. The facility is completely operational again. I couldn't have been timed more perfectly. I don't know if they meant that to happen, if they just waited until you opened the door, but I don't think they did. But, uh, I think I know what to do here. Because, um, I remember this from last time I played it. Just, um, while I was playing it, I remember what to do. It took me not too long. But, um, you just gotta get all through. It took me a while the first time I played it, though. Very confusing for me. But is there, there? It looks like there's an extra place back there that I completely missed earlier. And last time I did this, I died trying to go over those lasers, like almost dead there. And I didn't even know there's a way around. I think these test chambers look even better than they did before. It was easy, really. You just have to look at things objectively, see what you don't need anymore, and trim out the fat. I've got a surprise for you after this next test. Not a fake, tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. And real confetti this time. The good stuff. Our last bag. Part of me is going to miss it. But at the end of the day, it was just taking up space. Confetti. Yeah, um... There it is again. She thinks surprise means death. I guarantee you she's trying to kill me and stuff. I uh, I walked right past this button. I can't believe I don't even see it. But this is about I was thinking when I was looking at the thing that this is about the time Wheatley was supposed to come and rescue me. I thought I was gonna have a next chamber. So uh, that's why I really freaked out when this happened. What's going on? Who turned off the lights? Hey buddy! I'm speaking in an accent that is beyond her range of hearing. Look, Metal Ball, I can hear you. Run! I don't need to do the voice. Run! Run! Come on! Come on! Run! Come on! I'm closing the door! Okay, quick recap. We are escaping. Alright, that's what's happening now. We're escaping. Uh, so you're doing great. Just keep running. Uh, quick word about the future plans that I've got in store. We're going to shut down turret production line, all right? Turn off your neurotoxin and then come back. Again, though, for the moment, run! So it's what keep moving, like just keep moving! You probably wouldn't have been able to understand it otherwise. The irony is you are almost at the last test. Here it is. Why don't you just do it? Trust me, it's an easier way out than whatever asinine plan your friend came up with. A what? Come, how stupid does she think we are? I know. I, uh... I know that this isn't the right way to go. <laughs> There's even a heart on the side. That's not Gladys, but... Wait, just, where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, look. There's a deer. I knew, I knew. You I probably passed. can't see it. Get closer. Um, I guess this was a surprise. There were and kills me and he disappeared. I, I think I even saved the game. Yeah, I saved the game right before I went there. Oh. That's where you're supposed to go. It's the first time I played this game, I just didn't even go near there because I was like, why is he just gonna kill me? I knew that would happen. Come on! Come on! It's kind of a given though. Thank you. 
This oh, you're turret. a gunfire! This turret doesn't die. I'm probably gonna help in this point, but uh, I have to I'm trying to kill it right Searching. now. I'm trying to flip it on its side, but it's like... Sleep mode activated. I also Sentry can't find my way out of here very fast, dude. It takes me a little bit. It's kind of good. Who are you? Are you still there? It's kind of good. To my right, really. But eventually I figure it out. And, um... Yeah, there we go. You're okay! Great, come on! Yep. This way, this way! Courage! Uh, I like the sound of go, him, go, like, go, far go. away. He's like shooting a guy. Oh, this is crazy, dude. We're almost out of here! Keep bringing the whole place down! Hurry! Hurry! This way! This way! Oh, this way! I think I end the video here, so. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, if you enjoyed, like, subscribe. Next chapter is good. Uh, sorry about the. Uh, see ya.